Hey everybody, welcome. I got a letter in the mail with a nice uh, refrigerator magnet. It's from Chris over at Ultra Woody. Now, if you haven't seen this guy, you need to go over there and check him out. He does some really cool things. I think he was a tool maker by trade for years, but now he's working on a wood lathe. Um, he really does some great stuff. I'll leave information above and down below. And he's going to take the screw that my old sign used to be on. So he, there you go. Thank you, Chris. Hey everybody, welcome. In this video, I'm gonna take these four nine inch long pieces of branch and I'm gonna turn them into a cool little platter. So it should be fun. If you have any interest in seeing how I do it, stick around.
All right, guys, here's the blank. I got it out. I used the Pearl X Mac Macro Pearl and Blue Green. Um, really looks kind of cool, kind of swirly. You can see that it, it must have sucked up or floated up. It doesn't look like it floated really, but it must have sucked up a lot of the um, epoxy. I'm not going to do a second pour. I put the little face plate on because my worm screw is broken right now. I have one on order. <clears throat> but this will be the bottom. This will be the inside of the bowl. Let's go ahead and get it on the lathe and see what happens. All right, I got it mounted up here. I'm just going to go ahead and first thing I'm going to do is start just rounding off the outside, kind of center it a little. So we'll start there. So let's get that done. Because I left the bark on the on the logs that were in there, or the branches that were in there, as I'm trying to clean up the bottom, I'm getting like the bark is trying to peel away or whatever. I tried to kind of grind this out and fill it with epoxy, but I got a feeling it's not going to be great. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come in here, clean this out, and make it almost like a pocket, so it's its own uh, mold basically. So I'll just leave a little wall around here. I'll take it back off and I'll fill it with uh, epoxy. So let's go ahead and get that done. So it's been a couple of days. Let's see how this pour looks. That looks pretty nice. There's a little, looks like a bubble here, here, and here. But I think it'll look beautiful. Let's get it on the lathe. I've been sanding this for a little while. Um, still got some more to go, obviously. I'm trying to decide, I think I'm gonna mix a little bit of epoxy, maybe a clear epoxy or, or very, very light blue epoxy and just cover the whole thing again. But I just wanna give you a, a glimpse of, this is a denatured alcohol, a little glimpse of what it might look like. I mixed up a little epoxy 
and I put a tiny, oh shit, I melted the cup. And I put a tiny bit of um, blue in there, just so it's not 100% clear. And I'm gonna try putting it on here, see how it goes. Just gonna brush it on. So it's been a couple days. This dried up really nice. There's a couple little marks on it, but I'm gonna go ahead from 400 to 3000, and then I'm going to use the wet, wet pads. So let's get that done. So I put three coats of the Deft uh, clear wood finish gloss, waiting a half hour in between each one. That's what the can recommends. And on the last one, I waited, it's the next day now. So I'm gonna go ahead and put on some of my Axe Abrasive paste, see if I can't smooth this out. Okay, let's get it flipped over and start hollowing it out. All right, I have this turned around. I'm gonna go ahead and start chopping away at this glue block and start hollowing out. Let's go.
I have this sanded up, I'm gonna go ahead and put a thin layer of epoxy. I mixed, I hope it's not too dark. I put some blue in there, because I still wanna see the wood. All right, guys, here it is. Um, cool little bowl, I guess, dish, platter. It's about eight inches wide, maybe two and a half inches tall. I got my emblem on the bottom. I'm gonna fill this with epoxy later, clear epoxy. But I really love the way this came out. The four pieces inside. Um, the grain on this is really amazing. It's really got a lot of, uh, a lot of character in it. I'll give you guys some close-ups. Thank you so much if you made it this far. Give it a like, a dislike. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. And don't forget about my giveaway. You still have a little time to, uh, to enter. So, so just go to my video here and just sub my channel and leave a um, comment and you're entered. You got a couple, few more hours. I'll give you guys some close-ups. Thank you so much. Shut up and sit down.